Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki of the Pope's Worldwide Prayer Network, and today is the feast of a Capuchin Franciscan priest, scholar, and tremendous leader and preacher, St. Lawrence of Brindisi. Among his many gifts is one in particular that I wish I had, the ability to learn other languages with ease. He was so good, in fact, that besides his native Italian, he also spoke the following languages fluently, Spanish and French, German and Bohemian, Latin and Greek, and Hebrew. In fact, his Hebrew was so good that some people thought he was a Jew who had converted to Christianity. Knowing other languages helps you know and communicate with other people. But there's one universal language everyone can use that you really don't have to learn, but just have to use regularly. Do you know what that is? The smile. Smiling is good for you. It releases endorphins, those body chemicals that lift your mood. Thus, smiling relieves stress and anxiety, and it even boosts your immune system by increasing the production of white blood cells. But besides its individual benefits, smiling also communicates something to other people. Babies naturally gravitate towards someone who is smiling and move away from or cry when they see someone frowning. I can't help thinking that as Pope Francis has emphasized being joyful people and people who are open to encountering and dialoguing with others, he would also encourage Christians to be people who communicate with the universal language of the smile. So whether you feel like it or you don't, think about putting a smile on your face throughout today.